time to talk creative ways to display your favorite family photos. Blogger Audrey Keither is here. You have a really creative DIY project to get rid of the boring frames, but also to get the thousands of pictures we have on our phone that never see the light right. of day out. Right, because we all have, you know, everybody has all the photos that they don't ever print. This is a solution for that. Okay. Okay. And this is something that the kids can get involved yes, into. Yes, absolutely. It's pretty easy. It doesn't take much time so either. So this is the finished product. Yeah. So I just went through my Instagram feed and took some photos that I liked, threw them in a folder. And, and what I did is I, I print off of my home printer on a color printer, but there's so many services now that you can do to get like online, you know, printed like square photos from right. Instagram and all that. So what I did is I just printed out like four up on a sheet. Mm -hmm. And I used a little bit of a glossier stock to get some. A little did bit more. Did we lose your mic? Oh, Possibly. somewhere. Pardon me. I know we haven't even gone on a first date yet, Audrey, but I'm going to fix this up here. It's a first. Hope your husband doesn't mind oh, this. No. You're getting frisked on Better Kansas City. All right. There we good. go. Okay, right. we're good. So, so yeah, you print them off the and pictures. then you just cut them out. And so I went ahead and did three ahead of time. Okay. So these are on that glossy stock, as you see. Mm -hmm. And I like to do a mixture of maybe a family photo, then a cute little, maybe simple, like cactus photo, or you name it. Yeah. So what I did is I went ahead and pre-did this just to save a little time. So all you do is take a dowel rod and some yarn, and you just tie it on. Double knot it, triple knot it, just to make sure it's secure. And then you could take these wooden beads, and mm -hmm. you just tie a knot at the very bottom. Perfect. And then they have a place to, and it just kind of gives a little bit of weight and kind of holds the photos down. Okay. So then I'll let you do the last strand here. So you take your photos, mm -hmm. you lay them out how you're going to want to have them placed, and then you just simply lay this over and you just scotch tape oh. it. You can use masking tape. I recommend something that's either clear or really light okay. in color. I used a, a striped washi tape on my last one. You can kind of see through it. And so this, yeah. is, this is as simple as it gets. Exactly. And then you had a really brilliant idea about putting pictures on both sides yes. so that if it's a mobile. Yeah, if you don't want it hanging just flat against your wall, yeah. like maybe you want to have it in your kid's room and you want pictures on both sides, you, you know, that'd be a good way to like, you can get even double the photos. So this is kind of an idea. Yeah, so you yeah, do, like. do three or four however you want, and then all you do is you just Beautiful. tie it on here. Get them about, you want to make sure you get them all lined up And that's how, how many, how much did these cost you? The the, I think the set for, for three was a couple bucks, and then I think the beads were as well a couple bucks, so less than five dollars for the whole project. And then if you wanted to get your photos printed, that might add a little bit of a cost, but you can always use a color printer. And you can also spray paint, then make, get a metallic look. I did a copper look on the oh, one, like and then that. more of a natural look, and you could paint the beads to match the top part. I mean, there's lots of options. And your kids could do their own theme. Exactly really smart. I mean, when you think about it, displays like this are making a comeback because none of us have pictures that are framed anymore. Right. They're all in our computers. Yeah, like we start. have this weird scrolling montage on our computer, but when's the last time someone in your house wasn't on the computer? Right. So no one ever sees the pictures. Right. So this is a great solution for that. Look how many photos you can get into one piece. That's wonderful. Audrey, thank you very thank you. much.